Well, hey guys, hey, well, how you doing? Welcome to the ride. So, I started off American the Beautiful, and I am on my way to Angel Tech, you know, to test out uh, the Ace of Tie Fly X. On a taking my time, I'm not going too fast. Got some puddles out here, but more than that, it's, it's a beautiful day to ride. So this, good morning. Well, yeah, hey, um, BJ, hey man, I'm gonna drop those things off, the headrest and and another uh, uh, mount at Angel Tech, so you can go by there and pick it up whenever you whenever you uh, go by there, okay? So look, I got some little tournaments going on. I guess it's called pickleball. Sports Corp, yeah, pickleball tournament. Beautiful. All right. Yeah, I'm glad I got my mud guards on. A lot of puddles out here. So I'm on the HP today. So I knew it was gonna be some, some soft dirt, mud, puddles. All right, let's see if we can get across here. Okay. Now, this is why I like to ride through here too, because it's like a nature tunnel. A lot of shade. Just enjoying the breeze, the breeze out here. Good morning. I'm not gonna stay on too long because it looks like my batteries is getting ready to die out. Thank you. Man, they had a lot of rainfall yesterday. So it's quite humid and the mosquitoes are out. Right, guys hey i'll bring you back uh, once i get an angel tech i got a appointment in about an hour or so so i'm gonna take my time getting up there so it take me an hour probably less hey but bless you to you get out and do something well hey guys hey how you doing oh i just passed the seaton trail i tell you what man they got a lot of bikers and trikers out here today just enjoying their ride I don't pass Jesse, and he has a uh, one of those arm things. Hey guys, how you, how you doing? Hi. Good to see you fellows. Hello. How you doing? Good. I'm Toby. I'm Toby. Don. Dominic. 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 Oh, that's, I love this kind of bike. Try it. Thank you. This, this is called this is called Catch a Mustard Bike. <laughs> Catch a Mustard Bike. <laughs> it's a Volkswagen. Oh, you got it from Angel Tech? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, from Calvin, huh? Cal he's the guy that works. Calvin? Okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're with the therapeutic recreation program. Oh, okay. Um, so we have an adaptive cycling program. Yeah. Yeah. Good morning. Sorry about that. I'm here holding you down again. <laughs> How you doing? So is that where you guys started at today? Yep, we start at Angle Tech. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm on my way there. It's about 11 o'clock. Oh, nice. And uh, look up another trike. Yeah. Oh, that's wonderful. Nice to meet y'all. Yes, you too. Take nice care. You. <laughs> I'm on the cycling the springs. Beautiful. All right. I wish I would have known that. I would have been up there to start with those guys at probably nine o'clock or ten o'clock. So it's called a therapeutic. Uh, Recumbent and trike, re I guess it's rehabilitation. Man, that's wonderful. Okay. How do? Hi. All right, guys. Hey, well, I made it to the Santa Fe Trail. I am turning around. I'm getting ready to head back to Seaton Trail. 
I am. How you doing? I love trains. <laughs> yeah. So I'm actually almost 15 miles out on my ride. I gotta go get back. There's a lot of riders and trikers out here. Hey, blessings to you. And uh, I'll bring you back when I get the angel check. Oh, a nice puddle. Man, I'm so glad I got mud flaps, mud guards. That felt good. <laughs> All right, we'll see you later. Well, made it to angel check with, uh, let's see, at 20 miles into my ride. All right. Uh, so they had a recumbent uh, event here. I think they headed back now. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and check out this Azip and go around a couple times because it's getting cloudy over there. Real cloudy. But it's not supposed to start raining until... Okay, let's go check this out. All right. Hey, blessing to you. We'll uh, bring you back in a few. Well, hey guys, hey, how you doing? And welcome back to the ride. Test riding the Azup Tie Fly X Angel Tech is right over there. I'm just taking this trike Azup around and giving it a good riding. So there it is. And this is the color I've been looking for. It has a dream seat, 26 inch wheels all the way around. Uh, I'm just gonna try out the suspension, the front and rear so far. It is really good, uh, especially with the uh, the bumps. I would like to take it out on the, some trails, like I do my uh, my HP this see. But but wow, it has some really good suspension on there. That's a Bosch. There's no way. That's not, what is that? A Bros? Uh, that's just a demo for this trike. It doesn't come with it. It's just an add-on. Definitely won't be putting that on there comes with an eagle 12 speed suspension on here on the back full suspension that is okay and you can adjust this you can adjust it to your weight with that little blue knob in the back for your weight okay but we're gonna get on here and ride it around a little bit go over some bumps but i wish i, I did 20 miles coming up here uh, i took the hp through some some mud puddles some some ruts but this Azip is a little bit more extreme. That's what the X means. Uh, so it sits up a lot higher. But let's check it out. Let's try it. And the, I guess the Bros, it has a, has a, um, the, I would say the Bros assist is better than a Shimano. Okay. But we're just gonna ride around a little bit, go over some bumps. And I know that these uh, right here can, ugh, can actually go over. Look at that, it just went over <laughs> the, uh, the curve. Now my HP can't do that. Maybe because of the big tires and maybe because of the suspension, but they do got the same travel. But uh, I think the Aza, from what I'm feeling, it has a softer suspension going up some curves or if you want to jump the curb or going over bumps like this. Well, that's about the same. But I like it because it sits up, it sits up higher, a little bit stronger when it comes to off-roading. Off Okay, let's take this curve, let's take this corner and see. Okay, taking the corner is pretty, that's the HP. Let's see, one more time. Without me leaning, yeah. Without me leaning to the left or to the right, just let it turn hard 
and it pretty much hugs the road. Hugs the road. Let's see. Yeah. I need my GoPro. My GoPro's dead right now. Let's go see. But I'm gonna go up and look some hills over there on the over the bottom tree line. And let's try it out. Let me go get my my GoPro. It should be charged up by now. Alright guys, hey, how you doing? Welcome to the ride. I just made it to Angel Tech. Okay, get ready. There's the my HP, man, you, you can see it, it's muddy. Uh, really muddy. So I took it through a lot of mud piles and mud puddles, dirt, and I'm here to test ride the Aza. Okay. The Aza Top Fly X uh, 26 inch wheels. I've been eyeballing this thing for about a year now. And uh, so they finally got a, uh, a demo in here that has. The 26 inch so it has an eagle it has a bros um assist which you know it doesn't come with it it's, it's an additional if you want to add it to this most likely i won't add that because that just makes the price that much higher it has a dream seat uh i'll probably get that though but we're gonna let it test ride this thing and uh, i you know I've, I've been riding it since i got here and i pretty much i do like it you know so I definitely like the 26 inch wheels because man they, they it not like the the hp but it can climb or take curbs a little bit better let's go over here and see look how big the wheels sit up and i sit up just a little bit higher wow so this is probably something I'm gonna be looking at real soon. Well, when I, when I first got my HP, started riding trikes, uh, I was eyeballing this, but they didn't have the, the extreme. Okay, didn't have the extreme portion. Oh, that's nice. Let's see if we can get up this hill. Oh, wow, okay no slippage and the ground is wet and with the uh these aggressive knobs it was able able to grip onto that wetness and the grass and just push me up and the other reason why i like this look at the uh the curb here which is pretty good Something like that, how this came off that high curb, that's about eight inches. You know, I probably wouldn't do that with the HP because of the tires don't sit up so high. But that was really good. But watch this. See that right there, just came up on that curb? HP, no. Come back down. That is wonderful. That's something I couldn't do with the HP if I wanted to take a, a jump a curb or something like that. Okay. But the the assist is has a lot more torque. I would say that this Bros is better than the one I have, but again, it's gonna cost you. So look at this. Has the uh, it's not a DI2, but it does have like electronic shifting, and it's a twist of eagle. Wow, and it does get up. That's 14 miles an hour. Whoa. Now, I love the HP because of the, the suspension and the way it takes corners. So we're gonna try it on here without me leaning. Okay. Let's do the left side, right side. 
all right or came up a little bit but i took it i took that curve around 10 miles an hour and that's pretty good oh man all right now i noticed they could take to get up on curves they need me. Wow. Let's see. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. Ugh. Wow. Okay. Look at that. <laughs> oh, it took that curve. No problem. Uh oh, I got it. I got a stick in it. But yeah, I jumped that curve. <laughs> oh man, okay. I'm digging it. Let's go find some bumps. I'm going a little faster. I'm going to lean into it. How you doing? That was good. So I'm taking these speed bumps a little harder. Right there. Okay. That felt pretty good. We're gonna take this curb. <coughs> Let's take this curb, see what happens. Oh wow. Look at that. I just went over that curb with no problem. The the tires are so big that it just sinks into the curb and just comes right on over. You know what? I know it's gonna start raining soon, so I need to go ahead and put this up and get on ahead and head back. So I gotta uh, ride back down to the American the Beautiful. Uh, I think it's like maybe 12 miles. Yeah. All right, guys. Hey, blessing to you, and we'll talk to you later. We're gonna do a side-by-side -side comparison with the HP right there. Yeah. Hey, Kurt. <laughs> okay, well, here's my side-by-side -side of the HP uh, Scorpion FH26 full suspension compared to the Aza. It is a little bit wider. I'd say a couple inches sits up a lot higher uh, i do got the premium seat on the hp and there's a dream seat on the azip let's pull it this way okay. there we go so looking at that i'm liking them both i, I love my hp too but it's if i want to go off a little bit uh rough terrain than what I've been using for the HP, which does well, but this is a little bit more aggressive. Okay, and the, the, the height difference, uh, let's see, this is 
oops, I'm trying to see the height difference to there is a little bit higher than the HP. So it looks like the, the distance from the bottom, I got a good three inches of clearance on the on the exit versus the HP. So this sits up a lot higher. So and I like the way the battery too is a little bit higher than a frame. So if I want to take, you know, go over some rocks and boulders or whatever, the battery won't get affected. You know, so the HP does too. The battery sits up a little higher, uh, a couple inches, but you, I can tell the difference from the height difference from the frame to the ground versus the HP. I mean, versus the uh, Azer. Okay. Side by side. Okay. All right, guys. Hey, I need to get on back. Hey, bless you to you, and we'll talk to you later.